Honda CB500F, 2019-2021, Review Makes a fantastic first, big bike. With its extra grunt, weight loss, big bike build quality and refinement, the A2 Ready 2019 Honda CB500F is anything but a cheap and cheerful workhorse, or stepping stone to better things. Whether for the daily commute, weekend fun or your first taste of life without L-plates, it's a simple, but vibrant, involving machine in its own right practical, easy to ride, fast and thrilling. It's not lacking in power on everyday roads, or poison the corners, and is thoughtfully lavished with the kind of touchy-feely quality and detailing that makes you realize that Honda really does care. Ride quality and brakes. Arms, legs, wrists, neck and bum, knees and toes, all get an easy time on the long haul and with a seat height of just 785mm and squishy suspension, it'll be easy for most to get their feet anchored down at a standstill. A new slip and assist clutch is the smallest ever fitted to a Honda and is 45% lighter at the lever. Gears now feature 9 smaller dogs instead of 6 for a slicker changes, but it sometimes finds a false neutral if you hammer the revs between first and second. Engine. The Honda CB500F specs say power remains at the allotted A2 license-friendly 47 brake horsepower, but beneath that ceiling is a bubbling cauldron of grunt, relatively speaking, of course. A 4% gain in power and torque comes from new inlet cam timing, a bigger airbox and straighter inlet tracks. The extra mid-range boost is amplified by new mapping that's slightly less top-endy than the 2019 CBR500 RS and a 2 kg weight loss, gained from lighter gears and subframe, a smaller battery, ABS pump and thinner plastics. Reliability and Build Quality our Honda CB500F owner's reviews are varied, with one reader complaining about corrosion and poor build quality, and another waxing lyrical about this being the best CB500 ever. Value versus Rivals With its aggressive creases and sharp edges the CB500FS new bodywork, drenched in deep paint, has more than a sophisticated air of Italian design about it. The general finish, including the engine and Autosol shiny exhaust headers, are more like you'd get on a 10 grand super naked, let alone a machine costing nearly half that. Equipment How's this for detail? The back edge of the front mudguard is lipped to deflect air over the Euro 4 compulsory reflectors. Honda fits a normal mudguard to non-reflector bikes. An aggressively angled new Honda CB500F exhaust can features revised internals and twin exit pipes. Specs Engine size 471 cubic centimeters. Engine type liquid cooled parallel twin. Frame type tubular steel diamond. Fuel capacity 17.7 liters. Seat height 789 millimeters. Bike weight 189 kilograms. Front suspension 41 millimeters show a forks, adjustable for preload. Rear suspension show a shock, adjustable for preloa. Front brake 320 mm pedal disc with twin piston calipers. ABS. Rear brake 240 mm rear pedal disc with single piston caliper. ABS. Front tire size 12070X17. Rear tire size 16060X17. MPG, costs and insurance. Average fuel consumption. Annual road tax 73 pounds. Annual service cost £120. New price. Used price 3400 to £5,300. Insurance group. How much to insure? Warranty term. Top speed and performance. Max power 47 brake horsepower. Max torque 32 FTLB. Top speed 112 miles per hour. A quarter mile acceleration. Tank range, 